thanks a lot. So, yeah, it'll all come together. See you, mate. with the sun this high in the sky when I'm on the water, but anyway, usually I'm well gone from the ramp at this point. Let's go and see. No one's caught anything out there this morning. They've left them all for me apparently. Go and give it a red hot crack anyway. Be a bit of a later start than even I planned. This is the stuff you deal with, I suppose. But you come a bit out a bit later, and there's crowds everywhere. Old buddy can't get his started. And it's a brand brand new Yamaha 30, and he's just not quite got it right. So. Might see if I can go and give him a hand. Got it. He nailed it. It's game on. Welcome back to my lure box. I'm out on the ski again. I'm getting as much ski action in as I can before we leave for our ultimate fishing trip around the country this year. We're only a few weeks away now from uh, getting out of the house and uh, the house is gonna be rented and uh, getting on the road. So there's been a lot happening, some late nights of prep and uh, some late morning starts now because of these late nights. So I've been caught out. This is the latest I've hit the water in as long as I can remember. But I'm ready to roll. I got my uh, laser pros ready to go. There's a special one here today that I can't wait to put back in the water. So that's gonna happen this morning. I've got live baiting gear and it's so clear out there. I'm hoping there's going to be bait schools and birds and I can go and chase after those for a bit. Maybe drop down a livey and chase something big. Uh, what else? Beautiful conditions. Oh, it's stunning. Look at everyone. 
you probably can't see it because of the GoPro, <laughs> the way the GoPro shows things at distance, but it is lined with people out enjoying Currumbin Creek, the best it's got to offer this morning. Now look, I've been running competitions for fishing lures and lure boxes full of lures. And that's happening in this episode. At the end of this episode somewhere, I'll uh, go through some of the details on that. But there's been loads of kids that have been hooked up in the last week with um, tackle boxes that'll sort them out, whether they're fishing freshwater for Bass Saratoga, cod, yellow belly, um, and then saltwater stuff brim, mangrove jack boxes, flatty boxes, estuary boxes, there's been a load of stuff and DVDs go out to all the kids in the last couple of weeks. So uh, it's time to switch it up and you guys, you followers, you adults that have been watching my channel for a while now, we're going to run it on YouTube. Okay, there's a lot of guys that just follow me on YouTube that have not got Facebook and they've been commenting so we'll, we'll work it out here somehow. I'll think about it this morning, get my head around it and at the end of this video we'll come up with a plan. Uh, but I want to get the lures that aren't coming on my trip around the country out to you guys as a thanks for your support, your interest in my videos. It's meant a lot over the years and it's continuing to grow and uh, boy, I just feel really fortunate with where it's at at this point um, and it's meant we've been able to uh, get away on our trip in really good shape with some of the support I've received back the other way. So um, yeah, it's exciting. Thanks to you guys that have been commenting or emailing me about the trip. I love to read those and um, it's been great to hear some of your stories as well. That's more than enough chat for an intro, I know, but uh, there's a lot happening, so I like to keep you up to date with what's going on on the channel. It's time to go and get it. Let's go get that mackerel that I'm desperate for. Here's the plan folks. I've got a brand new Qantas, big laser pro by Halco, and one that I found up a gum tree years and years ago when I was chasing jacks. Had about 30 pound line on it, some big teeth marks and hook rash, and some dirty, dirty old uh, singles on it. I reckon they were either trolling and it had just found its way into a creek that I was fishing for jacks, and uh, or they were chasing jacks with it. With singles which is interesting and I reckon that that could have been the case because the singles were around the other way to try and make it a little bit weedless or, or snagless but nevertheless that's what we're doing today it's the 20 year old Halco Laser Pro versus the uh, recently purchased one they're both the shallow running version so those nice slender bibs so I can get a little bit more speed up and um, the new one's got a leader the old one I can't find one for I might pay the price for that. Let's see what happens. All right, let's go.
God, this is gonna be the highlight. I don't need to fish, this is just unreal. Seeing these dolphins, they're just surfing with the skis sitting on the brake behind. Oh, mate, does it get any better? The massive turtle out here. Oh, I've been trolling for, oh, it's at least an hour, and I've gone from Palmy Reef right out past, way out past the gravel patch. I've been uh, right the way around, I'm out off Mermaid now. God, it's been amazing. Some of the sea creatures I've seen out here today. <laughs> A massive tiger shark, way out, it was about six k's out. Massive, big four metery or bigger, I reckon. And uh, turtles and dolphins. No bust ups, there's nothing doing. And uh, all I've got to show for it, it's 150 mil of weed. <laughs> so I reckon I'm gonna try with a livey somewhere. I'll, um, I'll head back down to the reef, I reckon, and do a little drop. There was bait there, there's always bait there kicking around. So I'll, um, I'll have another go at that. Hopefully pull something, but what a morning, hey? <laughs> Just no fish, come on, come on. Do you know what has been interesting though? This old doer swims as good or better than the new one, I reckon. I was starting to test it like I like to do with any lure. And I was testing the speed and this thing was true, well past the speed that I could run the other one at. Amazing. If you've got a suggestion for a high speed lure, I want to do a little bit more of this stuff before we leave. We've got time, we've got a few weeks. If you've got a suggestion for a high speed lure, let me know, because I want to get out of here and have a bit more of a go. Love to know what you use. All right, let's go. Right, folks, well, that's the end of the session. I've been out and given it absolutely everything. It doesn't always come off, especially offshore as I'm learning the offshore game. It's a lot of fun, but uh, certainly got a lot to learn. It was dirty out there today. I tried to find clear water, but couldn't get it done. I live baited, I dropped lures down, I trolled for hours way out offshore and uh, saw a beautiful big tiger shark up near the four meter range, which was epic. Uh, dolphins, big turtles, it's been stunning out there today. But we're going to finish on a positive so the giveaways I've been doing for kids for the last couple of weeks I've literally given away hundreds of fishing lures some of them not even used still in their packets and uh, I've put them in my lure boxes and sent them out with some DVDs now it's your turn you guys on YouTube that have been my followers and such a great following of uh, subscribers for such a long time now this is the best way I know how to give back to you guys as a thank you and uh, for your interest in my videos so what I'm doing is I'm boxing up lures I'm going to send out full boxes of lures, my lure boxes to you guys. All I need down in the comments for you guys to go into the draw is a fishing tip. So that's what this whole channel's been built around initially, and it's branched out into adventure and now, you know, our touring year around the country. But if you can throw down a luring tip, maybe something that you picked up off me or something that you'd like to share with the rest of the subscriber base on this channel, I'm going to put you in the draw to win a box of my lures. And there are DVDs also to give away. I'm gonna get rid of absolutely everything I can. So uh, make sure you put a comment in there, a tip to share with our subscribers, the, the fishing community that follows my lure box, and you'll be in the draw to win. And I'll draw it probably early next week. So stay tuned to my channel. I'll make sure I post up in the uh, video subsequent like that goes after this, who the winners are, but I'll also follow up with DMs in that comment section below. Guys, thanks for following. I'm looking forward to the trip. I hope you are too. There's a lot coming this year on my lure box, so stay tuned and I'll see you in the next video.